first mention of astaxanthin was in a paper from the 1950s. Not many people still today know what astaxanthin is. There are 55 clinical studies that show that astaxanthin might help you improve eyesight, skin health, muscular health, joint health. It helps to maintain healthy nervous system and a healthy oxidative balance. Alkaliv is a microalgae company. We cultivate microalgae, a single cell organism, and uh, out of this algae we can get astaxanthin. The microalgae industry is still very young and uh, it's basically uh, becoming an industry at this time. So most of the companies are small, but uh, the future prospects are very, very good. The key aspect to how Iceland facilitates the astaxanthin production is the fact that we have access to clean, renewable geothermal energy close by, water in abundance, untreated. The low, stable temperature of the, of the region is also a big plus because this means that we have less bio burden, which translates into less contamination risk, but also the fact that there is less need for energy intensive cooling. We can now operate in a greenhouse facility, utilizing the, the sunlight and the radiation which this brings over the, the course of the year to add additional productivity to the whole process. So in addition to using the high-tech LED lights which we have developed in-house, we will have the sunlight as, as kind of an added bonus in that process. We are using sustainable energy, we are using super clean water, uh, and also many, many more regulations. Uh, our enclosed re reactor system uh, uh, allows us to achieve very high yields of astaxanthin production. Uh, this is an uh, unparalleled system, uh, and I think uh, among every other company similar to this, we are doing the best uh, in, the, in terms of production of highly pure, sustainable astaxanthin. Hematococcus is the magnificent creature which we rely on in our process and astaxanthin is a particular compound which we extract from that um, biomass which we produce. The, the journey of the algae starts out in a clean room where the algae is cultivated on petri dishes and transferred to slightly bigger cultivation volumes in a stepwise process. When this part of the process is over, we move over to the production part. The production part is split up into three distinct phases. The green phase, the brown phase and the red phase. In the green phase we try to mimic photosynthetic uh, conditions. It's a little bit like growing a plant in your living room. You provide uh, optimum sunlight conditions, you provide optimum nutrients and you try to keep the algae happy and growing. And in that brown phase we modify those external conditions of the algae uh, and in response to that, the algae adapts and starts to accumulate astaxanthin to protect itself from those conditions. And then we move on to the red phase, and this is where the astaxanthin accumulation continues and moves to the next level, with the aim of producing uh, as high of a yield as possible in terms of astaxanthin percentage. For the downstream processing of the algae, it starts with a step called dewatering, where we remove most of the water that was used during the cultivation part. Then we move on to the cell cracking step, where the cells are broken open to make the astaxanthin bioavailable. This is then followed by a drying step to yield dry biomass. So for the last part of the downstream processing, we run that dry biomass through a process called supercritical CO2 extraction and this yields a material called oleoresin. This is then further standardized and refined, and you end up with this. Sustainability is a core of our business. We aim at being net positive to the environment. Therefore, we take extreme care on, on our waste. We are working on a contract with our supplier of energy to uh, start grabbing the the little amount of uh, CO2 that they release, they will take it, they will clean it up and we will use it to feed our algae and therefore we will be negative on the CO2. We are part of the whole supplement industry. 
Our main markets are in North America, in Europe and Eastern Asia. Our production annually is about 1,500 kilograms, but after our expansion, it's going to be about 5,000 kilograms. Our vision is to, to continue to grow, to start cultivating other species, to produce more ingredients and uh, expand uh, into other fields as fast as possible. The market is growing 15 to 20 percent every year. So by the time that we have finished our expansion, the market will have grown more than our expansion. Ten years from now, when this company is 20 years old, it might be 10 times bigger. The future is very bright. There are more and more ingredients coming on the market that are taken out of uh, microalgae and we believe that we can keep our position and, and grow faster than the others, we can expand faster, we can merge with other companies and I have a strong belief that uh, this is the way to go. Consolidation and, and uh, expansion hand in hand will create a much stronger company and the industry overall will become much stronger in the coming few years.